peace, love, energy, and light to all my beautiful aborigines, all my beautiful Tanshinous ones, all my beautiful indigenous of the Americas. How are my beautiful, beautiful, beautiful ones doing today? We're right here in the heart of nature, baby. Over here by Henson Creek. Dude, to be honest with you, I didn't even know this was back here. This is like, some of it's gated all, some of it's not. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I wanna come here at night, either tonight or tomorrow night, and blow, and blow one down, you know, to break it in, you know, just to get the complete feeling of this nature, you know? Get a vibe right with it. So this is quite nice. I was gonna jump down and do the video from over here, but I don't know how I was gonna get up. So, <clears throat> this is it, you guys. Make sure you guys do your due diligence in law and studying this truth and also with nature. The only way to vibe in the universe is to vibe with yourself and vibe with mother, man. All this, we're from this. We're, we're from all this. All the vegetation, all the, all this carbon. We're of the land. We are this. And... I'm going to do a video on water because water, my God, water is actually living. It's like a living entity. It's like a whole spirit, like the life stream. I'm going to do a video on that later. But this is, this is it's quite nice back here. Take nice walks, bring your loved one back here, anybody, you know, don't matter. But it's pretty fucking dope. So just whenever you guys get a chance, wake up early, you know, your day's off, just go in nature. Enjoy nature, enjoy being out here, and just appreciate life. The only way you can really appreciate life is if you're out of the matrix, if you're out of that, you know, that brainwashed, time-driven, father time, chronos as world, you know, that illusion of time. Because time really doesn't exist. It really doesn't. Life isn't nothing but a long day. And every time you go to sleep, it's like an RPG game. Every time you go to sleep, you're basically just saving your data. <laughs> Whenever you rest, you're just saving your data. Ain't no day one, day two, day three. No, dude. Life ain't nothing but a long day. And you make best of this motherfucker. Boy, I tell you. You got to make best of your days, you know? Just go out, look how the birds chirp, look at how the bugs move. You go around bees, they don't sting you out here because you know they're, they're in their habitat, their natural habitat. You're not intruding, you're not colonizing, or you're not disturbing. So it is so, so, so natural. And I really didn't know this trail was back here. I'm about to start doing my videos back here, y'all. Look how beautiful this is. What my man say right here in the heart of nature, baby. <laughs> yeah, this is yeah, this is uh, this is uh, the spot. I might start growing some shit back here too. You feel me? Pick a little designated spot, start growing some herbs back here. There's a lot of sunlight as you can see. So yeah, this might be a spot where I start growing some herbs. Hell yeah. Grow some little cayenne peppers and shit. I'm gonna have my own little garden back here. No, I ain't, I ain't gonna hold you. This might be this this might be the movie, y'all. <laughs> but definitely, definitely get out there and enjoy. Go to like if there's any national parks around your area, go to those parks, learn about those parks, research those parks. Cause they're probably areas where our ancestors roam. You know? Just connect with the energy. Once you start connecting spiritually with the kinetic energy from Mother Earth. A lot of things will just start coming to you. A lot of things will just start popping up. A lot of... You'll start meeting entities, people, interdimensional beings, um, other life frequency beings. <laughs> you'll start meeting different people, different creatures, and different things. And you'll start entering your life. You'll start noticing different things. And you'll start rising in consciousness. The less you stay from nature, the less you'll rise in conscious. It's just that simple because this world is definitely... This life is definitely about vibrations and frequencies. You just gotta vibe high. If you're vibing high, there's no way you can have a fuck. I mean, excuse me, French. There's no way you can have a bad day. 
No matter how bad the day is, just keep vibing high. No matter what happens, just keep vibing high. Because tomorrow, you know, today, not even today, life ain't nothing but a long day. Tomorrow ain't nothing but a long way. You dig what I'm saying? So you must enjoy this. I want to hop in, grab some of that wool and throw on my face so bad. It is scorching out here, by the way. Why do not want this little, little snake nest? Little, oh, roots. Little snake hole right there. Alright. It's a little spot where the little beaver and stuff go down to get to the water right here. Yeah, I might be on my Steve Irwin shit over this drain. Yeah, and I actually ran into a beautiful, beautiful cardinal. Beautiful cardinal. I'm like, how the hell? Cardinals get down here. I thought it was in St. Louis, but hey, I guess that's just the myth. You know, birds fly in the gather, you know. They travel. Whew, look at that hill right there. It look like a snake right there too, big ass. I'm not going over there. Y'all see that black thing? I don't know what that is. But yeah, just, this is so beautiful, just be out here in nature. It's so beautiful, I just gotta get out here and enjoy, you know? Get whoever you have with you, gather your coworkers, gather your family members, gather your neighbors, your friends, you just, Walk and talk, man. Just walk, talk, smile, and vibe. It's all about vibing, y'all. If y'all not vibing, y'all not riding. You hear me? If you're not vibing, you're not living. Because that's all it is, is frequencies, man. I don't know how more specific I can tell you guys, but that's basically all it is. This is look at this shit. This is nice. This is nice. You get the green, the green hue is from the algae. And there's little fishies in there. Dude, this is all right, dude. I ain't gonna hold you. Nice little blunt route if you guys want it, you know? Just beautiful nature, man. Just get out there in nature and just enjoy. Don't sit up in the house. The house is like, I just think a house is like prisons, man. Like schools or like concentration camps. Like you just got four walls. Back in the day, we didn't even wake up in four walls. We had the TPs. We woke up in the Trestrohedron. We woke up in something that collects the kinetic energy from the Earth. We woke up with our frequency already rising because of the way our, the geometrical shape that our buildings and our houses was made. You know, we lived on mounds. So there's no like pyramid structure. So the Earth just automatically died, excelled our consciousness why we were sleeping, why we were astral projecting, you know, just why we're resting. It excels and just rises our consciousness because we lived in tetrahedrons, like we lived in triangular structures on top of triangular structures that help conduct that kinetic energy. But now they got us in this fucking cube, dude. They got us in a box, you know? They got us looking at everything like it's four dimensions, everything's four sides. You live in a house, four sides, four blocks. You wake up in a room, four blocks, four walls. Everything on this planet got four sides to it. Everything you see has four sides to it. And it's like they want to keep us in that box. But break out that box, man. Break out that box. The strongest structure on this planet is the tetrahedron. It's a triangle, triangular structure. You know, you keep stacking them upside down and over, upside down and over. That's a strong ass structure right there. So, you gotta stop living in the box that they want us to live in, you guys. You gotta stop living in that box. You keep living in that box, you're gonna go crazy. You're gonna develop anxiety. You're gonna develop schizophrenia. You're gonna think you're stuck and you're gonna tr you're trapped. Then once you do find out the truth, it's gonna blow your mind and you, your schizophrenia and anxiety might just go all over the charts, over the roof. So, it's best to break that shit down now. Because for those who don't know the truth, oh, the truth is going to hurt. It's going to hurt. For y'all, y'all still stuck on religion? Oh, it's going to hurt. We ain't need religion. We never needed religion. It was always spiritual beings, energy, love, and light. But that's all it is, you guys. Get out of nature and vibe, man. Enjoy this sun. The sun is sending our bodies codes. It's sending our melanin codes. It's just... It's just this... 
it's just so different to what we really think this world is. The way we collect data, the way we live, we just gotta understand. It's, it's totally different from what we was taught when we was born, you know? It's totally different from what we was taught in school. Once you start living off of energies and frequencies, you're really start, hold on, time out, y'all. I'll just find out one of the pool house. <laughs> the little hole in that tree. Little hole in that tree. That's we need the pool house and that's piglet house. I'm sorry, I just love nature. I love animals more than most humans sometimes. Well, I do like animals more than humans. Cause an animal will let you know straight up if it's fuck with you or not. A human gonna lie, a human gonna gonna beat around the bush. But an animal gonna let you know if you fuck with you or if you don't. They're gonna bite you or you're gonna stay with you. Whew. Alright, family, I ain't gonna keep y'all too long. I'm gonna let y'all get back to y'all today. I'm gonna get back to the skate. And y'all just have a beautiful one. Get out there, vibe, and enjoy. Remember, life isn't what they told you. It's so much better and so way far beyond that. And it's just, it's, it's fucking beautiful, man. It's beautiful. So peace, love, and light. We all out here bring a towel because I'm sweating like a mug. So one love, family. Peace.